How's it going everybody? You're watching Budget Build Garage. We're doing Taylor's Tech Tips today and we're going to show you guys how to bench test your starter. If you're having problems starting your car and you've checked the battery and it's good, there's a good chance it might be your starter. Uh, the best way to do that is to pull it out and test it. Alright, so the way your starter works is once you're turning your ignition, uh, your starter is going to receive power, the Bendix gear is going to pop out, and it's going to turn the flywheel, which is essentially going to start your engine. Alright, so in order to test your starter, what you're going to want to do is send power to it. So we have ourselves a portable jump starter. You can just use your battery and some jumper cables if you have those. Um, so let's go ahead and put the positive terminal on and the negative, the ground on the uh, metal somewhere, on the starter. You're going to take a screwdriver, connect it to the positive terminal to the S terminal. First turn on your starter. Alright, and as you can see, um, we have the Bendix gear properly coming out all the way, spinning, and then also going back in all the way, so that's good. Um, there's no excessive heat, so that means that we've got a good, a good starter. If you have excessive heat, you're looking at a bad starter. If your Bendix gear isn't coming out or it isn't coming, going back in, you also have a bad starter. So that's how you bench test the starter. Uh, hopefully you guys found it helpful. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed the video. Hit subscribe if you want to see some more of our videos. And I will catch you guys on the next one.